And now for something completely different. Hey guys, Iron Fury here, and it's been a while. Especially since I've done anything on my own that wasn't previously streamed first. But uh, this is something I've wanted to do for a long time, at least in some form. This is Iron Fury Plays Lemmings, which, if you don't know what Lemmings is, Lemmings is a puzzle game where we have little lemming characters that we have to help guide toward an exit. And uh, this game is considered a PC classic, uh, which I normally don't play a lot of PC games, but uh, this game was also on various consoles and whatnot. Like, uh, I own the Sega Genesis version, but um, this version that we are playing is run on an engine called Neo Lemmix, which is... For all intent and purposes, the definitive way to play. It has a lot of modern... Uh, what's the word I'm thinking about here? It has a lot of modern features that help make the gameplay a little more streamlined and easier to access for, for people who probably wouldn't be so comfortable in the, like, the original DOS version of the game or the Amiga version. Uh, which is kind of where I sit. I'm going to tell you right now, I am not very good at Lemmings. Uh, if you want to see somebody who's actually good, check out Round the Wheel. Uh, I will leave a link to his channel in the description below. But uh, he's actually the one that introduced me to Lemmings. So, uh, let's get started. There are four difficulty settings. We have Fun, Tricky, Taxing, and Mayhem. But we're going to start with the Fun difficulty. And this first level is Just Dig. So, there are ten lemmings, we only need to save one, and we have a time limit of five minutes. And, well, we're going to start with basically tutorial levels. We have tasks on the bottom, and the one task we have is digging. So, we're going to do that. And, um... Two pauses. Or one pause as well. Okay, there we go. If I hit the four key, I can speed things up. There's not really much to see here. We literally just had to dig through and we saved everybody. So, yeah. First level, very easy. Our next level is only floaters can survive this. So, what they mean by that... This... Lemmings are going to come out of this hatch. They're going to start walking down and they're going to fall down. Now, this distance right here is way too high and lemmings will splat. But, if we make one of them a floater, he'll open a little umbrella and fall safely. And this is a little speedrunning trick. You can basically set them up as a floater at any time, and they will pull out their umbrella and fall safely. And since they're safe, we'll speed up to finish the level. Tailor made for blockers. We have 50 lemmings, 5 to be saved, with a time limit of 5 minutes. These levels are very easy, but, as it says, tailor made for blockers. So a blocker, we set one here, he will prevent lemmings from walking past him. And we're going to set another blocker right here. Is that splat? Oh yeah, I can zoom out. Is that splat? No, it's not. Okay. And we're gonna set a blocker here. And they're safe. So, so far, not too bad. Mostly just tutorial stuff. And if we press the six button, we can actually speed forward even more. But, we have three lemmings here. What are we gonna do? We're gonna nuke them. There's no saving them, so... And the level won't end until they're dead. Or I hit the escape button, but... We want to show off the little pyrotechnics. So, why not? Now use miners and climbers. So, we have one miner. Miners... They'll basically dig diagonally. And seeing as... There's no point in not making anybody a climber now. We're gonna 
Start with these two. We'll try and get everybody that's facing right as a climber. But climbers, as you can see, will climb up surfaces and they'll make their way to the exit. And I do believe that's everybody. Oh, one more. Yep, that's everybody. All right, we saved them all. You need bashers for this time. Okay, so bashers are basically, oops, didn't wanna do that. Bashers are basically, as they sound, they bash through walls. It's like digging, but horizontally. So we're going to make him bash. And you're going to... Oh, oops. Wasted a bash, but that's okay. We have plenty so far. There'll come a time where we won't have that many to just waste, basically. But for now, it's okay. Everything is cool, calm, and collected here in the fun times. Now, the cool thing about Neolemix which wasn't in the original DOS version, um, or any of the other original versions of this game, you can actually see, like, the the trail here that they will bash in. Now, these guys are safe, but I kind of want to streamline this, so... Let's, uh... Alright, they're all safe, so let's speed this up. Anyway. Okay, that's getting kind of annoying. Let's there we go. A task for bombers. So in Neolemix, bombers will go off automatically. But yes, that does count as killing a lemming. In the original lemmings, there would be a timer. And you'd have a five second countdown and then the lemming would explode. In this case, bombing is actually made easier because they go off right away. You don't have to worry about timing it at all. And you know, let's raise the release rate. Seeing as we can. Oh God. I apologize if that was not comfortable for your ears. Builders will help you here. So builders, as the name implies, they can build a bridge, and we can actually see how far it'll go. Um, let's go to about here. Perfect. And I'm gonna raise the release rate. Because that's fine, I don't need them to... I can have them all come out at once, it's not a big deal. Now, I'm going to try and not let anybody fall in here, but if they do, then we'll have enough to hopefully build them out. But I'm going to basically start spamming builders. Because I need them to make sure... Yeah, like, I don't care if they start going backwards, I just... But anyway, after so many... Uh... After they use so many blocks, you'll hear a ticking sound when there's like three or four left. Uh, the lemming will shrug, and then he'll just keep moving forward. So that's your little indicator that it's time to use another bridge if need be. But we got a couple of these stragglers. Let's uh, speed them along, get them to the exit. And uh, we will see what all that liquidy bullshit is later. Not as complicated as it looks. Oh no. But the exit's right here. What do we do? Block. It's that easy. And bomb. Very easy level. It's a cute little trick though for uh for those who don't know what they're doing. Okay, as long as you try your best. So, this is another case where I am going to immediately set a blocker. And 
and then bash. And we're done. Very, very simple. Oh, I have to actually do something with you. Let's bomb you. That might help. Let's get us out of here. <laughs> here we go. Simple enough. Smile if you love lemmings. Well, I certainly like lemmings. So I'm giving a big old smile. So what we're going to do, this guy's going to drop first. We're going to have him dig. This guy is going to make it out, so he's going to be a floater. And he's also going to be a blocker. Now, hopefully I can do this right. Wait for him to... You know, let's raise the release rate while we're at it. I don't need anybody splatting. Ah, shit. That's okay. We can fix this. If I press the 2 button. And then... There we go. And they should all be safe now. But yeah, unlike in the original Lemmings, we can kind of fix our mistakes here. So, let's take care of him. Keep your hair on, Mr. Lemming. So this is going to teach us something else. This basically means we cannot dig or bash in the opposing direction of the arrows. So, like, we can't just bash through this and then they're free. No. We're going to have to come up with another solution to help them out here. And we're going to start with by having two climbers. And they're just going to kind of march over. And we're also going to make them floors because that is splat height. You're going to block. Now I need to do this a little. There we go. And then he's going to bash. And now I'm going to blow you up. Now, notice he didn't make an indent in the ground here. This particular type of ground tile is steel. Lemmings cannot, under any circumstances, bash through steel, dig through steel, mine through steel, blow up steel. It is impenetrable to lemmings. But, uh, you just keep on digging there, my friend. Let's raise the release rate. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're gonna... You are gonna do that, huh? You know what? I'll let you live. I'll let you live. You did your work. You did good. No point in making you die. Patience. Okay. So, we're gonna do a thing here. We don't have to do it. But I'm gonna let one lemon go... And I'm going to build a blocker trap. And now all the lemmings are confined in here. They are safe. He's going to bash. Speed that up a little bit. Ah, shit. And then he's going to build... Ah, nope. I need you to build again. Get back up there. Oh, no, bomb. Now he's gonna bomb. And because I can, let's let's cut that bridge off a little early. And I've created some butt cheeks because I'm five. And the lemmings are all safe and sound. We have saved more than we needed to. We all fall down. Okay, so this level is actually a level that will appear four times. One in every difficulty. And right now we have to save 20 lemmings with 20 diggers. So, as you can see, this is splat height. And what we're going to have to do is all the lemmings are going to walk out here... And one by one, we're going to have to make them all diggers. Because they will dig just enough that it will no longer be splat height. 
So what we're going to do is we're going to start speeding this up. And quite frankly, I want you guys to come out a little faster. You know what? Fuck it. I think I can manage. So let's... Come on. Okay. Dig. 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 Oops. Too quick. Did I mess this up? Okay, I messed this up somewhere. You know, we're just gonna restart. I'm gonna let them come out at their normal speed. But I am gonna speed the actual thing up. I got a little ahead of myself, which happens, you know. I can do this. Since we have the room, I may as well use it. I'm thinking of later levels where we will not have the room. I'm gonna start conserving a little space at least. Okay, there we go. Much better. Let these uh, stragglers get through. Alright, and we saved them all. Origins and Lemmings. Okay. So here, I think you can kind of see the premise that we're going to be going with here. We're going to basically be mining, building, mining, building, so on and so forth. So, I think I'm actually, I'll wait and have you mine first. Do I need to set up a blocker? That's more what I'm interested in. No, I don't need to set up a blocker. Okay. That is high enough that it will block them. And it's going to basically involve a lot of waiting. Because once he gets up here, I'm going to have somebody bash. Did I... Oh. I need one more. Ah, you fucker. It's okay, we can fix that. Nope. I want you to bash. Then immediately build. And bash. There we go. Just had to do a little precision there. Which, of course, is made easier with Lem... With Neo Lemmix. Lem Mini is a different thing. That's a Java-based Lemmings uh, engine. Which used Java. So... Okay, get you there. 
And once he's done building, I'm going to bash again, and then I think they're home free. So. Yes, they are. So, we can speed this up. Get you fuckers in there. Are they still coming out? Oh god, yeah, they are. Let's raise that release rate. Because we do have to be conscientious of the time. We have plenty of time right now, but later on, we won't. So, like, we may as well get used to doing things uh, expediently now. Don't let your eyes deceive you. Okay. So, let's take a look, Ski. So, we're definitely going to bash. We're going to bash and bash and bash. Uh, we're going to build... And I'm going to actually need to set a blocker trap, so... I'm going to do that first, and I'm going to let one lemming basically do all the work. So... We're going to have this fella right here. He's going to be our blocker. And now we can raise the release rate, because... There's no reason not to. So this fella... He's going to do all the work. And we can speed this up a little bit. Ah, you fucker. There we go. Alright. And he's going to bash again. And then he's going to bash one more time. Alright, now we have to get ready to start using our builders. I'm gonna actually let him get as low as he can. Nope. Right there. There's probably some purists out there who'd be like, how could you use that? Anyway, once he gets over this gap here... We're going to have him built here because this right here is a trap. It'll actually take lemmings out. We don't want that. So we're just going to build up here and the lemmings will be home free. And we can speed this up because, you know, it's just building. Like, you don't need to keep your eyes on that too much. Uh, one more should do it. Alright, he is home free. And build? Is that gonna do it? Like, is he gonna be able to... Nope. You know, I'll let you watch that. And yeah, see? He's dead. It's kind of gruesome to fucking make him come back from that, but... I digress. And he should be safe. He can walk up. Okay, he's good. So what we're going to do... I could save him, but I'm not going to. We just want to get out of here, so... Okay, and they are accounted for. Don't do anything too hasty. So... I think it's pretty obvious what we're doing here. We're going to build a blocker trap, and then we're going to build to heaven. But, we have eight minutes, so that gives us plenty of time. We will have a version of this level later, where we will have no time. Anyway, let's build our blocker trap. You... You. And you. Release rate up. Let's go. Anyway. 
You may have noticed that a lot of the music here is... He fell in the lava. Can't have that. You may notice that a lot of the music here is public domain. And, uh... Yeah, they did that for a reason. Because, you know... Why, you know, pay for music? But I digress. In, uh... Other versions of this game... Uh, the Super Nintendo version of this game. This says Heaven here, but it would say Paradise because of Nintendo censorship. This level isn't even in the Sega Genesis version. In fact, a lot of levels are omitted from that version. Which may actually warrant a playthrough someday, because it's a... It's a vastly different enough game that it kind of can warrant it. Anyway. Yeah, I know. This isn't the most exciting thing in the world, but... You should only need one more builder after this. I don't need you splatting on me, my man. There we go. And now you should be home free. And that means I'm going to bomb you. They're going to move on to the exit. And you can die as well. And that's some spread out butt cheeks. Yeah. Easy when you know how. Okay. This this is definitely going to be the most difficult level that we've encountered so far. But. You may be thinking, well, it's easy. We can just, you know, bash through here and maybe put some floaters here. Nope. Not enough. Splat height. Definitely splat height. And if we march down here... There's actually mashers that are traps. I don't remember if this works in this version of the game, and we're going to find out. But in other versions of the game, you can actually cheat steel. If you, like, dig up, dig down partway and then dig through and get, like, a mixture of the two, you can cheat it. We're going to find out if that works here. If that doesn't work then we may have to do, like, a weird dig or, like, build kind of exercise, and I don't really want to do that. But you can see we have our mashers here. The traps are showing. I'm going to quickly set a blocker here, just for now. And then I'm going to set a digger and I'm gonna bash no it does not work in this game okay so restart I'm gonna let one one lemming is gonna go through Ah, oh, man. I don't care if he bashes through that right now. I'm gonna have you there. And we're gonna have to do this as much as I don't want to. You're gonna build? Please don't hit the trap. Okay. That's gonna be annoying. But that's okay. We're we're allowed for this to be annoying right now. We could also do that, so Now you can bash. Okay. We can blow you up. Actually, before I do that, let's get guys bashing. If I hold right on the uh, arrow keys, 
or hold left or right on the arrow keys, I could choose which lemming I choose, which lemming I highlight based on the direction they're facing. So I want one aiming to the left. And then you. And you can blow up. And I think we are good to go. None of them should hit the traps. And we are, in fact, home free. Hell yeah. Let's block and blow. Okay. They want us to use blockers. We're not doing that. There's a level later on where we won't get to use blockers, but honestly, since bombs are automatic in this, in this version of the game, we don't need them. But we also want to avoid the fire, so we basically have to choose the appropriate spot to go boom. So here, 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 and here. Bada boom, realest man in the room. Let's raise that release rate. Y'all are free to go. Yippee! Ya motherfucker! All right. Take good care of my lemmings. Okay. So this level. Let's take a look, Ski. What do we got going on? Well, for one thing, we're definitely going to have to build. I think for the sake of being safe, since we can, since we can get away with shit, it's fun after all, I am going to set a blocker trap and have my man up in the front there do all the work. We can also raise the release rate. There's no reason not to. So, you keep walking on, my man. Keep walking up toward, you know, walk that way. Don't delay. And then he's going to be Le Bildor. About there. I'm going to keep my eye on the prize here. I want him to bait. If we're lucky, he'll build just over that and not have to walk back. But if he does, it's also not that big of a deal. Perfect! There we go. And now, you die. And you die. Thanks, butt cheeks. Come on, boys. You can make it. You got time. There you go. All right. So next time, we are going to be going to LemCon 1. But that'll have to wait until then. So until next time, take care.